This Florida cooking segment brought to you by the Florida Department of Agriculture and Consumer Services. Hey, today on the show, we're cooking Florida beef. That's right, citrus beef with herb sauce and grilled veggies. Mm. Oh. Well, Chef Justin and I are out here in a cow pasture, and oh my gosh, these cows are getting uncomfortably close. But uh, Chef, today we're cooking good grass-raised Florida beef. That's right. What are we doing? What do we need to get started? Okay, look, we have these beautiful Delmonico's or ribeye steaks, and these are from Florida Ooh. Fresh Meat Company. Look at this beautiful marbling, wow. grass-fed right here in Florida. It doesn't get any better than this. So the first thing we need to do is get our veggies ready to go on the grill. Some Florida eggplant. Beautiful eggplant. I'm gonna cut this on the bias because it needs to come and be done exactly when the steaks are done too. Can I feed this to the cows? Yeah, you can. they'll probably like yeah, that. The cows. So there I'm just go, cutting buddy. on the bias here and I'm gonna make a few slices. You can take ah, the skin off like or eggplant. you can leave it on. Mm. I'm just gonna set this here. Eggplants can go in. Mm. Next, some Florida zucchini. For this, I'm gonna just trim off the sides. See if they like zucchini. Okay, we've got some nice big mushroom caps here. These are gonna be excellent on the grill. These beautiful little sweet peppers that were also grown right here in Florida. Look at the color. Some yellow squash also. Just gonna cut these into quarters. Beautiful. And then how about just a little bit of onion also? Oh yeah. Now that we've got our veggies sliced up, we need to season them up. This is just a traditional steak spice. You can make your own. Just a little fresh ground salt and pepper would be perfect. And I'm just gonna drizzle with a little olive oil. So now we're just gonna toss these. We wanna get this nice and coated. Okay, these are ready to go. Now let's season up our wow, meat. That's good, Chef. Okay, we're just gonna put a, same thing, just a little bit of dry spice on here. If you want, just salt and pepper would be phenomenal. Yep. So we just want just a little bit on here. Both sides, they're talking to you. They are talking to us. Let's get these bad boys sizzling. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. Oh man, I love that sound. Now we can go ahead and start placing our veg. Get in there with your hands. Get in there with my hands. Get in there. There you go, right across, yep. A few of these peppers in the corner here. Big slab of onion right there. Yeah. So while this stuff is going, I'm gonna go ahead and make our sauce. Now this is the citrus part, right? This is the citrus part, And you're gonna let me squeeze the orange, right? I am. Got a little bit of fresh oregano, rosemary, thyme, and a few chives. Okay, I think it's time for us to go ahead and Move we'll our them. steaks just a little bit. Okay, what I want you to do is give it just a little bit of a turn. Quarter, a quarter turn. turn. Keep it on the same side. One more. Squeeze this half in. No yes. seeds, please. Like yep. this, right? I'm going in with a little olive oil, too. Citrus. And then I'm going in with a little bit of garlic. Gonna get this all working together. Man, that stuff's smelling good. We're gonna use this to base, so I wanna put half of it, we're gonna save as a sauce, the other half we're gonna use as a marinade. So we wanna separate these two. Mm. All right, Chad, I'm gonna do the first one and then I'm just gonna let you go to town with this. Just full scale drizzle everything. Drizzle everything, the veggies, the steaks. Woo, I think everything's okay. been drizzled. That's perfect timing because our veggies are done, our steaks are done. Chef, these look pretty good. Our, we're ready to plate up, right? That's right, but for steaks like these, we need to eat in the dining room. Oh, mm. good job, guys. Good job, chef. Tender delicious. and delicious. Absolutely wow. delicious. Mm. For more information on this recipe and many more like it, go to our website at howtodoflorida.com. This Florida cooking segment was brought to you by the Florida Department of Agriculture and Consumer Services.